Yo, what's going on today, guys? It's Versa Collectibles. We're back for another video. Today, we are going to be doing a booster box battle with my boy, Ryan, a.k.a. Cardbreaker. And we are going to be opening up this Crystal Beast box here today, guys, for the video. So sit back, relax, and uh, hopefully we take a W today. You better... You better no monster go ka hasto! Ore no aga kita! You better no nagare o tsuka no saino ga aru wa. You make so, hanakso, mimikso no mo ga. So shite, ikubik no effect o hasto! Hajimete yarare ru yatsu ni nare ru te koto o sa! Kurushimi to kanashimi no nagare ko so. Yo, what's up guys? Welcome back to the channel. It's Versa Collectibles. You know the drill. We maybe upload every like three months or so. So this is our regularly uh, three month video here. But as you guys saw in the intro, you're going to be doing a little box break with the homie Ryan or card breaker. Before we get into anything, we have to get this out there. Please go over to his channel, link in the description, sub, bell, comment, everything. Dude deserves it. I respect him a lot. He's an awesome friend and he's just he's a cool guy great collector and most of all he makes good content like you guys watch my video and you're gonna go watch his and you're gonna see who puts in more effort you know what I'm saying like I just like having fun and doing videos um, but he really puts in the time and you know he's always trying to up upgrade his content whether it's like equipment wise quality wise whatever he opens like he he does it and I really think he is super underrated for what he does so please if anything just go and sub to him and yeah hopefully we can win this thing i really doubt it um i've opened this set two times off camera just kind of with some friends and you know i love gx so seeing crystal beast finally get um some love and you know getting the first printing of like the the dark crystal beast is really cool but overall this set is super <laughs> lackluster like there's not even a starlight crystal beast which i think is ridiculous they kind of shot us there but we do pull a starlight I would like the access code talker obviously because of the big price tag on it I would just sell it and buy other stuff with it but if I were to get there's only one card in starlight that I would actually keep I'm gonna open this off camera really quick Rusty knife. but I would really like the super poly because um, you know that's a big uh, GX card you know Judai used that super important so I think that would be really cool but um, otherwise, you know, I do uh, like the Crystal Beasts in this set. I'm still missing a few of them. I would like to get play sets of three. I'm actually going to be buying uh, some new binders here soon. And so I will be getting um, a new binder specifically for my Crystal Beast collection. So anything I can get play sets of three, I would like to. And so having these in a play set would be amazing. But we just got this guy off. Um, I got nothing else to say right now. Let's get into it. Um, uh, we've never pulled a starlight on the channel, so if we pulled one, that would be amazing. Up here, God, I'm turning old. You guys don't want to know what my setup's looking like right now. Um, I got my Jordan box right here on top of my trash can with my light here, and I got the other light behind my monitor right here where you can't see. Um, and you can see like all of the mess over here, man. I'm actually. I'm gonna be leaving for Japan um, in exactly a week from now. Uh, we'll start with the left side, see if we get anything good. Um, so I'm super excited for that. Gonna be visiting my fiance, and gosh, I I've been taking like a break from collecting, probably like a month or so, a little more, because I've just been saving up. And um, yeah, I just can't wait to see what kind of stuff we get. Ooh, okay, so we got Crystal Beast. That's fine. Uh, I'll set that to the side. I'll be saving that up. I still need Amethyst Cat and um, Mammoth in the, the dark form, and those are the ones that I'm missing right now. Um, so that would be cool if we can get those. But yeah, I'll be leaving here soon. I'll be going for three months. So I plan to do just everything there, man. Like, I'm so excited, and I'm, I'm super excited to go to like card stores and video game shops and everything out there. I think that would be really cool. All right, we got Doom Kaiser, uh, nothing crazy. DD Crow, surprisingly. Uh, doesn't hold much value in this set uh, like literally every card in this set is literally pennies like I could literally like go oh my god I keep hitting the camera so pro so unprofessional I'm so sorry guys but I could literally go into my couch right now and I can literally afford every card in the set just by <laughs> digging through my couch looking for spare change 
The only things that are good is um, Access Code Talker is probably the best card you can get in Secret and um, and in Starlight. So it's funny that like this is a Crystal Beast set. Like literally nothing is expensive about it. <laughs> like from the Crystal Beast like perspective. But you know, who cares? They they printed the card, so I'm happy about that. But we are gonna take down Ryan today. We are gonna pull Starlight for the first time ever on this channel. Uh, like I said, any cards from the style would be cool. Okay, Blackwing, nothing too crazy. Um, yeah, and if we can pull those two Crystal Beasts, that'd be awesome. But um, hope you guys have been doing good. Hope you had a good Christmas, and this video should go up before um, New Year's. Hopefully you guys have a good New Year's too. What, tell me what your guys' New Year's resolutions uh, are in the chat. Or in the chat, God. I, well, if that doesn't explain anything, I've been streaming a lot. I don't really post about it, but um, in the comment section, in bookmark, I'm curious if that holds any value. I'll put that there. I guess there is a lot of Toon Chaos reprints in here. Um, but yeah, let me know what your guys' resolutions are. Um, if, if there's one of mine, it's a big one. It's just being more active. It doesn't necessarily have to be like going to the gym, but man, like I need to get back into playing sports, skateboarding, like doing a bunch of stuff. Um, I just became so fucking lazy over the years, guys. I think that's just everybody at some point. Um, oh, let's, oh no, I do have this one, dang it. I was really thinking I didn't have that one. Still cool. Um, I thought that was the mammoth for a second, but yeah. Uh, yeah, I just haven't been super active and like uh, low-key been putting on weight. <laughs> Not like crazy amounts, but like, uh, you know, I'm just kind of like, dang, like, I gotta get off my ass and stop being lazy and I'm hopefully going to Japan will do that for me creator I don't think he's anything uh, too crazy literally I don't know if I'll be popping <laughs> much prices up on the screen because every card pretty much that we pull right now I like I said I can literally find I can buy the whole set from the freaking couch change that I have uh, sitting in there but um, yeah I'm hopefully going to Japan will uh, crystal piece nice will get me in shape a little bit you know they eat a lot healthier but it's also a lot cheaper so maybe i'll eat more i don't know yeah, but i'll be i'll be way more active um i'm super excited guys like i've never been before i've been dreaming of going for such a long time um you know covid really ruined a lot of things for me with it uh so it's really set me back pretty far uh but you know i powered through i just kept working hard and you know i'm just that much step closer like to being able to live there which is my big dream um me and my fiance will be getting married uh sometime next summer and so that will become a reality eventually soon and then i'll be able to get my visa and i will be staying there which will be awesome okay i actually have not seen this card after all the times i've opened this set so i have no idea i will just keep it in this pile um nothing's really worth sleeping right now until i get um any of the Crystal Beast cards that I'm missing, uh, which I said are just those two. Obviously, if we pull like an Access Code Talker, um, Starlight or Secret, that would be awesome, guys. I keep hitting the camera. I got, I bought this new, um, like, uh, tripod, and it's so bad. I literally went to Walgreens and just picked it up really quick. Ooh, Royal Straight Slasher. I have not even seen that card either. Finding some cards I have never seen. Crystal Skull. Okay, that's interesting. Um, but yeah, so this thing is really terrible. It literally doesn't even extend up or down. Like it's so, my hand is so close to the camera. <laughs> so I apologize. Um, but yeah, Brian, uh, hope you're doing well, dude. Uh, we're trying to take you down. We're probably not gonna pull anything. Cause like I said, this set is lit like, literally starlight or nothing. If you get lucky, you get an access code talker. You make like 20 bucks back. Like even these evil twins, I don't even think anything right now it is wild. Um, yeah, hopefully, uh, hopefully we win. I really doubt it. If you pull a Starlight, dude, I'm more than happy for you because I just, I just want to see people do good. You know what I mean? Taking an L sucks, but, you know, we're, we're in it for the fun. All right, God, dude, I cannot open these packs. I keep hitting the camera. I'm so sorry, guys. Please don't sue me. I actually have not even seen this card. I'm seeing some that I've never seen before. 100 Numeron Dragon. Blackwing. And we got, was it, Plunder Patrol? Um, don't know if that's even like a good archetype. I, I don't keep up with meta or like meta viable cards, anything like that, so I have no idea. Let's take a look here. These packs, man. I've gotten my entire shop where I work at into collecting cards now, guys, and like 
they've just been buying like Pokemon booster boxes and everything out the ass. And so like I've been opening up Pokemon packs with them recently and um, like it's so much harder. These Yu-Gi-Oh packs, man, God, like I wish they go back to the old school stuff like 5D's era and back just, you know, it felt good to open something. Now it literally just shreds like paper and you're like, okay, I'll open this one. Okay, we got another evil twin and crystal beast. Okay. I have not pulled many of these cards. I feel like these booster boxes, they're really one-sided. Like you pull certain cards in one box and then the other box is something completely different. Like it has a own, like its own set of stuff. It, it's really weird. And um, you know, this set's not really that expensive. If you saw in the beginning of the video, I paid like 70 for this box or something. It's outrageous now because I'm pretty sure you can buy them for like 50 somewhere. Blackbeard. Curious if that card holds any value. Um, I haven't seen it before, so I'll just set it up here. Um, but yeah, we're already <laughs> like more than halfway done with this box. Um, but hopefully we get something good. You never know. Hopefully I can stop hitting the camera. Honestly, if we stop hitting the camera, that's that's already a win in my book. <laughs> All right. Got odd eyes for the dragon. I'm pretty sure I looked those cards up on TCG Player, just kind of looking at the set and like prices and stuff. And like I said. Not, not <laughs> it's very hard to win from the set if you don't pull a starlight. Um, so Rainbow, uh, the Doodle Beast. Like, this guy's so cool, yet yeah, he's literally like, I can go find like my first grade piggy bank and have enough to buy him. Like, kind of sad that like some cool new archetypes that came out like aren't seeing that much financial love. <laughs> All right, I hit the camera again, guys. That's that's an L. We already I actually just lost the video because I keep hitting the camera. It doesn't matter what we gonna fall over okay man i can't even get the crystal beast cards i want man we really haven't gotten much at all how many packs do we have left let's count all right there's one in there one two okay so we got five left. all right let's go in but i think this will probably be the last time i open this booster box i just wanted to open it up you know for the for the fun of it with the homie and um yeah but i'll probably just buy the other cards okay we got another royal guy and we are not getting crystal b stuff i have the rainbow bridge i just saw that but i already have a play set of those i'm pretty sure i have play sets of all these but nothing crazy all right we are getting down to the fire here we got that cool guy again and then a crystal beast ruby all right yeah if i find anything that's literally like a dollar or more maybe i'll pop it up on the screen i really doubt it all right so we got one or a few more God. Guys, I'm so sorry. Don't even watch this video. Just see the title. Go to Card Breakers video. <laughs> Just give it some love. Oh, let's go. Okay, I don't have that one yet. So I am totally happy with that. That's like the first sleeve card of video. <laughs> I actually just don't even own that one. Let's go ahead and get these sleeves up. You know, we got the we got the Miracle Fusion sleeves. I'll be really liking any GX sleeves that I can buy. Well, that's that's honestly the biggest win of the video like I'm just glad I pulled this now if we can pull mammoth that'd be awesome um does anybody know if that's like short print short print or anything like I have no idea but um let's go hit the camera again yeah 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 all right here we go we have got area we got some fright fur we got number two in shadow not pronouncing that and we got stone. All right. Now, we are already down to the last pack. We haven't even pulled a good secret. Like, that means starlight potential, or maybe we did pull a good secret. I just don't know what it is. But the first time I opened this, I did pull an access code uh, secret rare, and I sold that right away. Okay, let's. Ooh. Is she... I'm pretty sure she's pretty expensive, if I'm not mistaken. Nope pretty sure she holds some value i am not entirely sure but i will sleeve her up just in case but like i said uh this set is super hard to pull away from uh you know making any profit it's super tough but i did pull this card which is awesome i've never pulled it before so that's good and uh, if i find out if she is worth anything you guys would have already seen the price um so yeah guys that's that's it for the video uh, i was pretty short Ryan, I hope you did way better than me. I hope you pull a starlight. Um, give some, give the viewers some content. But I appreciate you guys watching. Um, 
yeah, I'm excited for everything that's coming up in my future, you know, still collecting. I'm going to go ham in Japan, uh, just buying awesome stuff and just living life. You know what I mean? So I appreciate you guys watching. Make sure you go check out Ryan's video and I'll catch you guys in the next one.